in this container I had lettuce plants that went to seed. The seeds dropped down and they germinated on their own. So I'm going to transplant some of these into containers. Here's some lettuce plants grew up right in the cracks of the stones. These are my favorite scissors for the garden. They're called Padrini. I just ordered a second pair on Amazon for $11. The reason I like these so much is because the metal goes all the way down to here. So it gives you a lot of strength in the scissors. I can't tell you how many times I've broken these other scissors. You can see the metal only goes down to right here. So when you put any force on it, it breaks the plastic. This pair I tried to repair with some JB Weld. And you can see the metal only goes to right there. That's why I really like these Pedrini scissors. Picking up some supplies from Home Depot. I ordered the gallon jugs online and picked free shipping where you pick it up at the store. The 511 fish emulsion was $18 a gallon, and the More Bloom 01010 was $17 a gallon. This is my other fig tree called a brown turkey fig. On my collards and kale, I've got these things called harlequin bugs. And the infestation isn't really that bad. There's maybe six or a dozen on each plant. Here's some of their eggs. And from what I've read on the internet, the best course of action is to hand pick them off the plants and drop them in a bucket of soapy water. Okay, it took me 30 minutes, and this is the result. All the bugs, I'd say there's maybe 100 bugs total. Okay, it's November 10th, and we're gonna get the first killing freeze tonight. It's supposed to get down to 28 degrees. So I'm gonna harvest all the peppers. So here's the yield, a whole bunch of bell peppers, corno de toro, and giant marconi. Got some of the serrano hot peppers and a few tomatoes. 
I also moved all the lettuce out here into the greenhouse. People have asked what I do with my frozen peppers and I'll add a couple into my soup mix. I'll heat it up in the microwave for about three minutes. I'll also take a frozen pepper, chop it up and add it to a salad. The secret is to chop it up while it's still frozen because once it thaws out, it gets kind of mushy. And then I'll mix it into the salad for a nice spicy kick.